I feel like talking to you today about the truth. Ikeniso. Inyaniso. Amaruri. Nete. We call it in different names. But the truth is one. There's a saying, Eti, there are three sides to every story. My side, your story, and the truth side of the story. Let's forget my side. And let's put your side, as, uh, your side to the side. <laughs> let's put aside your side. And put aside my side. All sides are sides. Let's remain with the one constant, the truth. Our families are Sazwani because of the truth. Siblings are not on speaking terms anymore because of the truth. Parents and children are at loggerheads because of the truth. Ekaya is not warm anymore because of the truth. What is the truth? <sighs> to ask what is the truth, you get answers, Zoguti, yeah, but that is your truth, and that is your truth, and there is your truth, you know? Many people have their truths. And when I'm saying what I'm saying, I'm telling you my truth. Again, sides aside, what is the truth? The truth is that which changes not, is that which will always be. It is, it was yesterday, is today, and it will always be that way. The truth is something or that thing that cannot be compromised by anyone's feelings. The truth is that one thing that cannot be compromised by anyone's opinions, even the unpopular opinion. The truth will never change because of an unpopular opinion, even, an, uh, even a popular opinion for that matter. The truth is the truth. It will remain as it is. The problem with the truth is that our world lives and strives and survives on a lie. Kriniswa Silfoni. Ambi obuzu mama kogu tuban babako. Uzo kala za role pansi atu ya mtuga. No omtuga nga umbuze uguti mama obanu baba. Hambi obuzu babu wa kuti baba siba nga agila ekaya bantu anabako. Anga kosha nungu kosha mzinake. Buzu babu wa kuti baba katika chewe nisibongo sako esgaba nungoba wenu sebe nisibongo sako. Baba kwa nga kukwate lunyaka onke. I keep him zinak. We take small issues and make them bigger than what they are supposed to be. Because as Kulum Kinis. I had a woman here once, I will not mention her name. Client doctor, but in patient doctor confidentiality. But these are realities that we are facing all the time. This woman brings her son to me, Uti Lomtuanawake Ukulang Engond. He's mentally disturbed. I examine this boy. Yes, he is mentally disturbed. What is the cause of this disturbance? This boy is crying out for his father. When you ask your mother, who is your father, Utin, she pushes me out the house. Uyalwa, she calls me all sorts of names. Okay. 
So what did you do about that feeling? I'm going to start. But at the same time, I realized that I have to support my mother. So I've got this love-hate relationship with my mother. So one day the mother comes here now. I call the mother over and ask her, who is this child's father? Yeah, we had to go through a whole battle only to find out that the father of this child is a neighbor to her cousin. So Lomuntu Aksiu Muntogute is not far away. Is actually quite close, even to the family. So close that the child has probably even played with the children Bagibo. So close that Abantu Bagibo have probably sent him to the shop. So close that he's actually had a conversation with his father. Now this boy is going to prison, this boy is going to drugs, this boy has didn't done everything. <clears throat> Are we to sit back and blame the child for the lies of the parent? And I know a lot of people sit there and say, yeah, Abba is always talking about women. He's never blaming the men. The men are as guilty, if not even more. Because it's your children that are not being told the truth of who you are by their mothers. So you are as much at fault, if not more, because it is your child that is growing up without knowing who you are. You are also not living in a truth. With these four children that you are raising in your house, how do you sleep knowing that there are five others that you are not even sure had supper? How do you sleep when you know that there are six others that you are not even sure are warm at night, yet you want to call yourself a father? And when your children ask you, Baba, how many children do you have? You want to throw a tantrum. But I've come to a conclusion. Truth without maturity cannot exist. You need to be mature in order for you to tell the truth. You need to be mature mentally, not physically. But Probably your father is Kelamfan. Usafara Makula Peck, Nekemche, Putinia Moto. Mama Friday says, Utuba Banges in Bonne. That's not a man, that's not a father. Kelamfana Leon Tole in Quenque. That's not a man. In daughter, I'll show you longing a crimson eye. In commons, your peg or ban with his pelleless by him. In gun is your peg or ban with his onkes, pili, les pelleless, yaz, chabli, as he shot. Umfaz or rabafaz, bow peg or ban with a mizinabo, as in him zabo, a goo cock shot eye. In daughter, a shonel way lang, a enga pandle go muswayo. Enga cosim sebenzi no balegile, a gion in daughter leo, that's a boy. I can't sit here now and talk about boys. I really can't. Can't talk about a 40-year-old man or Hambit Lap. What am I going to say to him? Can't sit here and talk to a 56-year-old man or Sashelum to Anona 21 years. What am I going to say to him? I can't sit here and talk to a man who has 15 children and he's only raising one. What am I going to say to him? They are insignificant. They are unimportant. They don't even deserve the name Baba. 
I can't call you a man. You're raising children. You are not supporting your children, but you are raising them. That's a father. You are in your home, your house, taking care of your home, your house, your family. That's a father. You speak the truth and you stand by the truth. That's a man. The only thing you have in this world as a man is your word and your balls. And if you break any of these two, you are not a man. You cannot be considered a man. A woman. <laughs> is not what you have between your thighs. To be a woman is to be an incubator of life, a giver of life, a builder of nations, a protector of homes. <sighs> Today we have slay queens. I was asked by one of the people Abba Sebenza are in a spa that I shop in close by. Oguti, she has a friend. Her friend is in hospital. Her sexual region is in trouble. She's constantly bleeding and, 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 and. My first question to her was, what is your friend's lifestyle? What, what do you mean? What type of boyfriends does she have? Does she go for people like me? Or does she go for people who drive big Range Rovers and have carry big wallets and put their trousers in the fridge? And she says, no, she goes for those type of people. Number two, what is her marketing strategy? <laughs> what is her outside appearance when she goes to these boyfriends? Is she collected and put together? Or is she what we call today a slay queen? And the answer was, she's a slay queen. And I said, that's why your friend is in hospital. She slept with a man who has money rituals, making him money. And he's obligated by his rituals to collect new girls every day to sleep with. Mantombazana Gnam daughters will spend a 50,000 of hard earned money just to sleep with you. How special is your vagina? How special do you think your thunder thighs are? No man is willing to spend a hundred thousand just to sleep with you and your friends. There's a culture now. If I want to go to a club and promote a new drink or promote a new CD or I'm a DJ or whatever, I've got my friends who are going to call girls, which girls are going to be paid to bring their friends over to the club. So for every girl, each, that girl is going to get 300 or 250 or 400 for each friend they bring to the club. So when uh, not show me, you think who show me actanda no show me is making money out of you, because la petla pini you're going to get free alcohol. Nishali se guma VIP mahala. In order for omani kani nchebe zungulu uguti bazo kono gun pick up alap. And when they do pick you up there, you have to pay for them away you drank or ngumu or ngumu away mina ngazi is French. It's moe, right? It's champagne. You're going to have to pay for it. How are you going to pay for it when someone was paid for you to get there? And you are 21 years old at that time. 19 years old. 23 years old. 24 years old. Are you not selling yourself? For a nice time, and a big Nigerian man who is a drug dealer, are you not selling yourself for Rubablaminu Amatenda, who cheats his way through life, who bribes 
his way to wealth? Are you going to be a girl of pilang a 25,000 rand monthly stipend from a politician or salary with penthouse yake? Driving a BMW? Onga itenga ngo itenga lwe ili boyfriend eno mfaz na bantuana just because he's an ANC big shot? Is that your life? Let's tell the truth to ourselves. If we can tell the truth to ourselves, we will be able to tell the truth to our children. And they will be able to live a truthful life. And when the truth is the truth in our families, maybe the truth will be the truth in our communities. What is the truth? Two years later, what truth is he telling you? Are you wearing the same Prada? Are you driving the same Mercedes where a faithful congregation yake? Ask us cool men kinis. As you get a spiritual master and a spiritual leader, but fun sabo African spirituality being a twasang. And then they go behind our backs, but it's totally a time. La. We must be shut down. We know who you are calling yourselves titles that are great above you. Sit back and tell the truth that we ain't gonna be able to get away when I'm not the truth. You're going to have to get away from this one. Shut down all these things and his hands are over with you. I will shut it down myself, Ling Yenzai. I'm taking out a national challenge here. Onko munto ne kiniswa gasugu maga kulumi kiniswa. Ona manga gashale panza tule. Nyabongo.